Highland Hardware owes its roots to Shopsmith. When I got out of uh, college, I went to work for a hardware store that happened to sell Shopsmiths, mm -hmm. one of the last hardware stores in the country mm -hmm. this was, that was sold it. My wife at the time, Sharon, and I were running the store together for a company called King Hardware. Uh, and we left and started Highland Hardware. Mm -hmm. And we had a woodworking community built around us uh, from selling chops to this. We added hardwood lumber, mm -hmm. bought an old uh, 1904 Fay and Egan 20-inch thickness planer, mm -hmm. and got hardwood from North Georgia. Uh, Uh, I started a catalog in 1981, mm -hmm. typed on an IBM Selector typewriter, mm -hmm. and uh, sent it out, and it evolved. Still black and white catalog. Yeah. <laughs> I think we're about the only one. Uh, uh, several of our employees have been here for 20, 25 years. Mm -hmm. uh, the newbies have only been here about 15 years. Mm -hmm. Me and my gal walking down the street, meeting everybody but the chief police. You gotta step it up and go. Yeah, go. Now I ain't seen Sally, I swear you gotta step it up and go. I know a gal, little and low, says she loved me, but she don't know more. You gotta step it up and go.